Hailing back from the days of Metarot 3 and the final of the mythical beast from that said game, it is KRN Zero Genius, coming to the game with a kit of Rebirth, Charge Plant, Charge Drain, Biped Legs, and the leg ability of Popper which grants a 20% damage reduction when meeting a certain Metaforce threshold. Now, it is really nice to see another of the Mythical Beasts from the early games finally make its grand re-debut and reintroduction into the more modern games with a kit that more or less remains relatively consistent with what they had prior to. Rebirth is a skill that we, up to this point, we've seen only on female type bots, which includes uh, Particle and, and Artemis and even Revive Angel, and that is Rebirth. And what it does, simply put, is it will revive a fallen ally back on the field to a certain amount of HP to keep the fight going and even change the odds of, of battle back in your favor. Right Arm of Charge Plant is a setup based skill which will put a plant on the field and upon completing any action while the plant is active will grant an additional bonus to Metaphor's charge um, upon, uh, upon the completion of your turn. And then last but not least, Charge Drain is a melee based skill that will simply eat, that will simply sap a certain amount of HP, uh, not HP, a uh, Metaphor's charge from the opposing target when attacking and used to fill their own gauge, which honestly will tie into Genius's leg ability pretty nicely, as once that damage, as it does require a Metaphor's threshold to be made in order to maintain that damage reduction. But on the topic of damage reduction, Genius's stats across the board are honestly really nice though. About 4100 HP for that head, about 3550 both for, for both arms, and even his legs too means that he can take a hit pretty solidly and keep on kicking. But then in addition to that, uh, with the mobility of 777 is a really nice sweet spot of where you want to be when it comes to a kind of like your general bipedal leg. An evade of 935 isn't too shabby, a little lower than what you really want for an evade, but still something that can be pretty easily overcome um, all the same. With the melee resist and shoot resist of 1101 and 1239 respectively, this does honestly mean that even before any bonuses or any... Uh, terrain bonuses or, or meta rotter bonus that genius can honestly take a hit pretty solidly and keep on kicking i'd even argue to a point that with stats like this it put him a little closer to what you expect a tank leg to be uh given that they normally have the higher shoot and melee resist together um of course at the cost of the lower evade and the non of uh, the non-existent evade and the lower mobility but with that being said genius does honestly take all of this in stride pretty nicely and uh, with a very solid kit and well-rounded kit that may not be a dedicated fighter but a dedicated support and metaphors interrupter or supporter given that he has given that he has both charge plant and charge drain he is honestly someone that you could make the joke of he giveth and he taketh away now genius is also capable of a meta change form where he will get down on all fours and basically keep the exact same kit almost verbatim with the exception of exchanging rebirth for confusion and his leg type from bipedal to float which will honestly change up his mob his game not necessarily enough to really make it a game changer per se, but enough to really, but enough to really help even the odds in the case that biped legs may not be something he's particularly good at using, or on a terrain that he's just not very good at, at being mobile in. Confusion, of course, is an ailment-based skill that, when attacking a target, will scramble their incoming commands and orders, which means for the next three turns or unless attacked sooner, will fo will force that particular target in question to chance attacking an ally or granting a support-based skill to the enemy, uh, which can really change up the field, especially at that last possible second where you least expect it. With this being said, though, with it, when it comes to his leg, when it comes to his stats while in, in meta change form, they really don't change all that much. And honestly, something else uh, Genius does have going for it is the fact that none of its skills while in change form require charge, which means Genius is is freely capable of changing back and forth almost as he pleases, pretty much relative to whatever kind of skill or that you're looking for, or primarily just down to terrain in question. Um, if some if it's something that biped just isn't good on. Uh, when it comes to the mobility stats, on the other hand, his his mobility actually goes down just a hair. Not enough to really make it noticeable, but it do, but in terms of flat numbers, it does go down. In trade of that, however, the evade does shoot up very largely to about 1040, and the melee and shoot resist do go up just a little bit enough to kind of make him just a little more resistant on the field than he was before. As a pure set score, with all this being said, I do have to rate him pretty solidly at about an 8 out of 10, given that he is a very solid and dedicated supporter type, bet between his passives with charge drain, with, with a charge plant and rebirth, uh, to his dedicated combat skills with both confusion and charge drain, to help stall Metaphor's fighters or even throw them off in, 
in the rare instance where they do end up attacking, attacking an ally instead of you instead. That being said, as mixed parts on their hand, it was a little tricky to actually gauge genius in this in, in this respect, given that the kit is basically the exact same in both normal mode and changed mode, with the exception of the leg type and drive A or head or head use. But with that being said, I do have to rate him just a little bit lower in the sense that if you do choose to mix up the parts, you do kind of mix you do kind of miss out on that float leg ability on, on the float legs and the confusion, which can make it so, which can make itself pretty nasty uh, once it is applied on the field to an enemy in question. But that being said, with Genius currently having the current and only male Metara that has the access to the Rebirth skill, this alone will make him a very big ticket item and someone that you can re you really can't go wrong trying to make use of or pick up if it's someone that you do want to go get a hold of. Especially given that in, say, EX Trials, where it might be male only or no females allowed, this will really be that game changer since now you'll have access to a Rebirth skill without having to have without having to rely on a female meta route such as Particle or Artemis or even Revive Angel.